There's nothing like competing in the Olympic Games, and this is, you know, beyond the team. This is certainly what this young lady has been dreaming about since she was a little girl. She said there is nothing wrong with saying, with hoping, that you want to be Olympic all-around champion. I think a lot of people think if you do gymnastics, you're in the Olympics, you know, or you're going towards that. People should realize, you know, not everybody has that physically and mental ability and um, being able to put the hours in the gym. When you're watching the Olympics, you just see the routines and you see how good they are. You don't actually see the practice that is put in. You can always go higher, you can always progress, and you can always do something bigger and better. If you would pick out any average person just, you know, watching, if you had them do the easiest skill, they couldn't do it. You know, it's it's a lot more than you think. We come in, we run a little bit, stretch, and then we um we go to one event and then we switch events and finish out our events and at the end I do some conditioning and I'm stretching. Let's just rotate these. Yeah. Do gymnastics because it's really fun and it's really enjoyable and you get to do a lot of cool stuff. It's fun and I get to challenge myself every time I practice and just a very good sport. I think it challenges you. <laughs> what do people say to you when they find out you're a gymnast? Are you going to the Olympics? <laughs> <laughs> Every time. And my answer is no. <laughs> and so would you want to make it to the Olympics? Yeah, I mean, that'd be nice, but it's not going to happen. <laughs> I don't really do it to get in the Olympics. Oh, can you do the stuff in the Olympics? Or can you do flips on the beam? <laughs> <laughs> what do you say to them? Uh, no, not really. <laughs> it's not realistic because if you want to be in the Olympics, you have to start out amazing. It's just very rare to do Olympics. And not a lot of girls are able to go for it. They can be fantastic gymnasts and still don't get to the Olympics. So. Go! Because gymnastics is not everyone's sport. Even if like you're really good at it, you're never amazing at gymnastics. Nobody's ever perfect at it. It's just it's certain people who can get that far. Just doing it for fun and still competing is just like the best thing in the world for me. I mean, the Olympics is, is pretty serious. It's very intense, but um, just to do it for fun, you have to love the sport to be into it because it's such a hard sport to be into if you don't have a passion for it. It doesn't matter. You can still love to do gymnastics and be really good at it, but it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. It's not about being the best in the world. It's more to... Um, just to be in a sport. Even people that do other sports, they don't make it to the Olympics and they still do it. It's for fun, competition. It builds your character and helps you conquer your fears. And I begged my parents to do it. And I'm just, it's, it's really exciting and thrilling because then you like, school, you can just go down in a split and everybody's like amazed. Because gymnastics is still fun either way if you get to it or if you don't because it's still challenging and you can always move up and you can always go down. Uh, it's so frustrating. Like you just keep falling and you're like, why can't I get this? It's so easy. And it's just, you just gotta keep pushing yourself. the backhand spring on beam. I think that was the hardest skill for me to get. It took me over a year to get that. It was just the best film in the world to land it on the first time. Every time you're trying to scale or you get scale, it's just you feel good about yourself and like you can do anything. It's an amazing feeling because you've tried for so long, you've prepared for so long and like it takes Sometimes it takes years. I feel that gymnastics prepares you for life because even though you fall on a skill, you still have to get up and try again. And even though like people will like hurt you during your life, you still have to like go on. Just you know what I mean. 
um, I think it helps in life too. Uh, I do some stuff that I, I would never think that I could do a couple years ago. Things that you can't always get what you want, you have to work for what you want and you can't stop ever. <laughs> of forces you to push yourself more than any other sport I've done. It can get really frustrating because even though you try to skill 20 to 30 times or 40 times, it still gets really hard and sometimes you still can't get it after that. So you have to build up your strengths and your confidence and you just have to keep working until you get there. Loving gymnastics means even if you don't have what you do, what you want, or you don't get what you want, you still keep going and you still, you still have the love for gymnastics to keep going. try to um, keep getting better so I don't know I just always wanted to I think when I see people I just I see them doing skills and I think wow I really want to do that one day and that that's what drives me because gymnastics you do it because you love it and even if you don't get to where you want to like the Olympics you still have the desire to like keep going It's about more than the Olympics. 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 It's about more than the Olympics.